but Lotric surely is a reliable name when it comes to the best price to performance ratio. And if you're following our channel for a while, you may remember the Velotric Discover 1 we used before. Gotta say that the precise engineering and skillful design is commendable. And today we have the best value fat tire e-bike, the Velotric Nomad 1, which we've been torturing for the last couple of weeks, so watch till the end. Velotric made an impressive first impression on us with both of their e-bikes. Of course, such high-quality packaging, protection, and coming almost assembled aren't something we see everywhere. However, we must say the design is commendable, and these fat tires also look quite promising for off the beaten paths. So let's put the battery on charge and talk about the bike a bit deeper. First thing we do appreciate about this beast is the frame. These are reinforced aluminum frames built to withstand the roughest rigors. And in case someone is wondering, yes, the e-bike comes in both high step and step through models. The e-bike is rated for up to 440 pounds of load capacity, and we found it amazingly easier to hop on. Speaking of that, just look at its ergonomics. Perfectly positioned aluminum alloy handles, mushy and comfortable seat, everything is perfect for taking on the toughest trails. Now hop on and let us share our riding experience with this bike. If we are more specific, we didn't really bother very much with its road performance. We wanted to see how well it was off the pavement, so we took it to Arizona's famous White Line for its ultimate test. Its stylish fat tires were more than capable of holding proper traction with much more connection to the ground. Now this is where we saw the difference from the others, as we felt a bit more balanced while riding some of the steepest uphills. In addition, these hydraulic suspension forks we found greasy enough to smoothen our ride on the trail. But what surprised us is that this bike didn't sweat riding steep uphills, even during full throttle mode. How cool is that? We surely didn't expect this much power from its 48 volt 750 watt hub motor. For a fat tire bike, we don't think speed really matters. It's the performance off the pavement. Yet we put this bike on a speed test and the results were rather appealing. It went as fast as 21 miles per hour on the road. Its Shibano RD M310 Duralier gave us a smooth shifting experience as well. But when we rode off road, it went down to an average of 16, which isn't really an issue here. An exciting feature of this bike is its UL2271 recognized 21,700 battery cells from LG and Samsung. Now this really hyped us up about its range. Although Velotric claims it can go up to 55 miles with pedal assist and 52 miles at full throttle, our test results were slightly different. We found its highest range about 50 and 47 miles in pedal assist and full throttle mode respectively. So yeah, we get that the difference isn't really that much, yet that power gap is noticeable during off-roading. Even with such heavy-duty performance and all, this fat tire e-bike supports front and rear racks to carry all the essential gear items. And we found it quite helpful, as the front rack has up to 33 and the rear rack has up to 55 pounds of load capacity. And with such innovation, heavy specs, and practical performance, we almost came to the end of the video. What do you think of this Velotric Nomad 1? Feel free to reveal your thoughts in the comment section. And please share this video if you found it helpful. And to know more about outdoor products, reviews, and buying guides, you can visit our website, GoOutdoorZone.com.